so finally i am recording in my windows all right so i'm using that obs software and um, i got a pen tool also properly and i'm using this mic also to record so the voice will be a little bit smoother i feel so yes let's see uh, now see look at this particular trade um uh, manapuram this is a btsc trade which i took yesterday i will show you what is exactly the buy price but uh, over here also i have a btsc trade uh, you know if 10 paisa goes 3000 rupees movement will be there so yes 0.3 percent is there just 10 paisa so 30 rupees stock only it's a future both are future carry forward positions now how did i find this i found this particular one from this method which i told you yesterday in my video volume burst on five minutes candle so i checked out the stock which is bursting post 12 o'clock okay three o'clock you can do it i what i did i took post 12 o'clock and i checked the fundamentals of it so i took the trade now i could have exited on the same day but i just thought i can take the advantage of gap up so i had to wait so i waited for my trades either you can exit during the day if you're taking early trades like intraday or else i'm taking mid of the day like post 12 o'clock i take most of my trades only for btst i take most of them uh, intraday i try to finish by 12 o'clock like you guys know why i don't like about 12 o'clock things can change anytime and yesterday i have an example so i posted in telegram also so uh, that's how uh, I took advantage so if you have not yet uh, watched this particular video uh, that is this is the latest video which I have posted yesterday so how to pick volume burst stock through scanners it will help you in intraday like I told you if you take before 12 o'clock all right and then you have to add some parameters of risk and understand where is your RSI and all those right remember those but I'm just telling you you can before 12 o'clock you can pick intraday stocks and after 12 o'clock or i would say for a beginner safest method is three o'clock okay so after three o'clock you can pick stocks for btst so that's how i picked my stock over here from this scanner i scan now in your example if you don't have the access like me see i have uh 200 back to 25 deploys 100 scans because i'm paying the 350 or 400 rupees monthly because i use it many things i use over here okay uh, so normally this search will be there but what i do i always put a nfo search and because i'm trading in futures i have to carry forward right so i put my nfo future here and then i take my trade then in cnc okay i more than cnc i do futures considering the um, leverage what i get two or three times also the brokerage advantage is there so i just do a search over here if i want i can change this to 15 minutes or whatever i can do so i just went with five minutes because 15 minutes takes a lot of time then i just gave a search over here okay so you can also just put some name and give a scan over here so whichever stock comes during that particular time see it's not that always it will be coming only when there is a proper condition only it will come so whenever a stock name comes then only you will take an advantage all right so whenever you get a stock also check the rsi levels and all those for short period of time so that's how i took advantage of uh, national lm uh, and uh, now this one uh, even most of the lockdown most of the places are opening their shops are opening and things are start, work has started so looking at that fundamentally also these stocks are getting some advantage to move forward so that's the reason i just took advantage on these stocks considering the long term of it and the btst thing also so luckily today only it spiked up normally sometime what will happen one day it may miss okay it may open and go sideways also i have seen such op uh, situation it's not that every day it goes up but luckily today it went up from this point if you see it has gone up like anything all right so uh, manapuram i have to wait for some more time uh, i think it is uh it has to deviate more at least one rupee if it goes only we get six thousand rupees right so yes i'll show you manapuram over here where is it where is it so in the web page you can check all the reports whereas in uh, mobile it is showing blank you cannot you know you can email you cannot see on the screen so here i'll go to my trade history uh, this is what uh, futures so nse futures uh 2021 and all right from april to what is the today june 2nd go so all the trades which i have done for this particular financial year will be coming here 
so if you see just find where there is a blank so here is a blank so that is manapuram uh, over here so 6000 shares is what we took right so 133.85 is my actual buy price on this particular trade so when i sell my shares it will come here 6000 sell and uh, whatever price i sell if i sell at higher price then this value also will be higher so for example here 61000 was there 83000 was the sell price so 22000 is the profit so when that is negative don't think it is a loss it is a profit that's how this broker is reporting all right so 64 uh, 6.4 lakh cares uh, 6.49 lakh now don't think he has invested 6 lakh 9 lakh see in uh, futures uh, carry forward positions you will get uh, two to uh, three times of margin exposure type so, okay some bro some stocks need only two times some need only three times you can check on zero the margin calculator for rough calculations so that's how i have got this much so now again i sell this eight lakh of manapuram with whatever price over there i will go and hardly 10 rupees uh, hardly 100 rupees to uh, 80 rupees or 120 rupees or 60 rupees will go for um, the brokerage so that you can check in zero the brokerage calculator why i'm saying is a lot of beginners will see this amount and they're like oh my god so much of amount and how much brokerage will go no it's all about percentage how much percentage you hit how much you make is important so check on calculator hardly 100, 150 rupees will go and uh, once that is done then this will be updated so this is my uh, angel broking account so i trade an angel booking account very safely like you know from before i am doing only cnc trades and uh, yes more than cnc futures normal orders that more than normal order, i would say it's carry forward i carry forward same day i try to hit if i miss my targets i carry forward my positions or i take btsd trades also so i do very safe trading here only if i'm confirmed you see even options when i was only confirmed i took a position that day okay it's not that every day i can take a position i took only one position on that particular day on this but whereas in uh, my uh, zeroda from the day one like you know i am doing a lot of experiments i do a lot of experiments in zeroda because this is where i lost my money this is where i learned a lot of hard things in my life so this is my battlefield this is where i experiment a lot of things so if if it is let it be in nse futures or when i started nse futures i experimented in this i have made losses in that when i started a little bit of options starting i didn't know first time i put around two and a half thousand around and i lost all that two and a half thousand around in options so i started hating options in the starting when i started so later now learning theory everything understanding one by one and slowly experiment in options so yes everything is experimented in this particular account so this account is a mess okay there is no logic to this account over greedy over trading everything is filled in this particular account but what i teach people when i have to follow right so that's how when i teach people i become more stronger and stronger so that's what you what you see over here i don't over trade i don't take much trades i trade for whatever i have and i make how much ever i can okay so that's the idea over here so if you look at the market market has already reached close to peak 67.90 68 so rsi is reached on a five minutes time frame so for a shorter period of time rsi is going to reach a overbought zone but you see yesterday even though the market reached the overbought zone it just went up because the volumes were so good buyers so many buyers were there the stock kept moving up and up currently it is moving around 1.6 percent so it opened here then first was a red candle and then you see proper greens going on so market is having some advantage today so stocks are moving uh, that is one advantage if market would have opened negative today that advantage would have been less on my stocks but luckily market has opened green and uh, it's going up okay stochastic has already reached top and um, when stochastic turns a bit i mean it will become difficult there will be small sideways pressure going on if there is no volume in buyer side okay so if you see um, national lamb or uh, i would say nalco is coming up back again all right so there was a small correction going on um, over here as and as and when it went to 31.50 people started selling the shares and it started coming down for five minutes 15 almost 15 minutes three candles so now again there is a small push from the buyers if you see the quantities over here <coughs> 
as soon as I told the quantity reduced anyways the quantities over here are comparatively increasing because it had reduced okay so it had gone to 18 lakh and it has come close to 20 lakh now now I don't blindly look into this number I don't trust it 100% but I'm just telling you when there's a small changes because I remember 18 lakh looking in my eyes so now it has changed to 20 21 slowly it is changing so there is some push and the stock movement also was seen so volume and price movement is been seen over here let's see if it can sustain because you know market has come down a bit so if you see market market is still coming down so that is one disadvantage as of now so once market goes up or a green candle starts if market can go up green then our stocks will get advantage manapuram is still in the same range uh, so if you see so Manapuram just went up again to 34 area and just came down so market is not yet supporting now market is dropping down from whatever early gains it had so my stocks are also having the same advantage so let's see if I can if the market corrects then I get advantage or I will try to book cost to cost above that and try to escape my trade so uh, if you see i just exited my position uh, i waited i waited i'm fed up of waiting so anyways i just exited my position around 30.95 so close to 8000 rupees profit on this particular trade 0.8 percent of the stock around uh, is what we booked so 30 paisa is one percentage of the stock remember 30 paisa movement is one percentage of stock so we have hit more than that so reason why i exited is because market you see market market is just coming down and i don't want it i don't want to see today green and then become red again and wait for tomorrow and day after tomorrow in case market doesn't come back again some bad news comes and things go down this market is very volatile you know that so i don't trust it 100 percent so uh, yes it went up it's coming down now again it can the journey may go up later part of the day or something but I don't want to take risk because end of the day I see money over here more than enough 100 or 150 rupees will go as a brokerage uh, rest will come back to you if you see soon after we exiting the stock went up like anything you see there is a blast over here so that's what I was expecting but anyways I booked my profit early on this particular trade uh, Manapuram finally Manapuram also got the momentum thank god I have not exited Manapuram yet so let's see alright guys so I just did a search right now NSC futures I'm just changing to futures like you know all right so i just got a stock that is nothing but mine tree so i'll just check the levels of mine tree and i will take a decision whether i need to enter it or not so this is how i pick the stock all right so if you see you need uh, for mine tree you need around 2.47 lakh so therefore i can buy one lot of this particular um stock for an intraday in case if i miss for intraday i can definitely hold it also so i've just checked the long term position of the stock also everything looks good looking at the rsi and stochastic is going from the lower levels still at it has chances to go up and all those so what we can do i'll just take uh one quantity normal order market order is what i will take so order has been placed so yes so 903.75 is our buy average so normally yes you can wait for a limit order and put your order and take so what happens in limit order the orders keeps getting skipped 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 so i will you know not get my buy point if the stock spikes up, spikes up. so i may end up taking in very higher prices now rather than that 15 20 30 paisa gap will be there above and looking at the stock it's a 9 rupees stock so for 9 rupees stock uh, let's say um your target will be see let's say 903 rupees stock into 0.3 percent is how much so 2 rupees 70 paisa is what you need to hit on this particular trade so if you add your uh, 
so 906.45 if you hit you will get your target in this particular trade if you're going for 0.3 and in between if you get a spike i mean you need to give some time for this particular stock because it is a five minutes volume burst right so it's a volume burst in five minutes uh, breaking the previous highs over here all the points over here so you see sudden spike happened now 900 and how much 906.45 so it has this side has crossed but not the current market price so 906 907 it has gone so it has crossed our area if you put a limit order now you see it will be done 0.3 percent so but it will be very quick anytime it can after two three candles it can reverse it's a fi five minutes candle okay so after two three minutes also it can reverse and come down so for shorter period of time yes it is bullish and try to take advantage of that point three and whenever i tell something don't copy and paste just like that do paper trading uh, anyways i will tell you about a paper trading platform today in today's learning video 7 30 video i will share a paper trading uh, application on which you can practice from now on smart trader family need to practice paper trading on a platform only uh, rather than if you're confused if you want to uh, do it on a paper or type it on a mobile rather you can take like a real practice on a real trades buy and sell okay without money basically so i'll just show you i'll talk to i'll tell about you uh, tell to what what am i saying so i'll just tell about it for you guys so um i think it's time for my for me to have my breakfast and have a coffee so i'm almost tired talking 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 so anyways uh just waiting for this stock to go up or either book 0.3 so you see 0.13 percent movement is there for 904.90 so we can either set our target here you see the quantities are you know there's a big gap here so let's say till 908 okay okay let's see All right, so if you see over here, uh, I mean, I just went to get my green tea and my stuff, my oats breakfast. So stock spiked up, right? Okay. So the thing is, whenever I go out or whenever I go away, things happen. Okay, stock will spike and then I exit stock spike. So it's all, you know, in intraday keeping your eyes on the chart is really important because you get some golden opportunities to enter, exit and all those. So if you neglect that, then you will lose the track of your volumes what you saw the movements the push all those things you will forget now again i have to look into all these things and understand okay these are the volume these are the quantities over here there's a push over here so if i hit exit now it will go at 9 10. <sighs> all right <clears throat> got some energy now so from tomorrow onwards, uh, my personal training classes are starting Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. So three days I'll be super busy. I will not be able to uh, do much of videos. I will try to record my learning video. 7.30 uh, learning videos I will try to record and keep. Uh, all right. And uh, yes, so we will use the paper trading platform like which I'll be doing today. So we will use that and we will do some observations in the market. So a lot of beginners who come and watch our channel can do paper trading like me. Uh, in the market so that they don't do much mistakes with their money so paper trading in that will have a uh, virtual money duplicate money so you can practice like real trading so that we will do anyways from tomorrow onwards we will do an observation type of videos i don't want to show much of my uh, how much money i make and all those i will tell you why uh, you know it, it is not good to show your live trading always because it attracts a lot of people so i'll just tell you about that later part so now the stock has moved around 912 so 0.92 percentage of the stock now 0.9 so you can see today 0.99 percent to 1 percent of the stock it has moved we have taken only one lot of my entry so that was a very good spike so you know how i captured the stock see the thing is every time people ask how do you capture a stock how do you capture a stock see um, every day there's a different situation how you take a stock every day cannot be the same thing is you show something they copy the same thing every day and then they'll say it's not working it is working yes it is working two days five days it's not that it's based on market situations so that's what I train my students mentorship I'm not training them any magic I'm just training them different situations how to pick a stock how to enter and all those so like this various other methods is what I teach them 
so that's how they take advantage and many things i cannot keep telling on the live trading because few things are premium only for my students so definitely i will not be able to share that on a public platform so that is under understood that every 100% of what knowledge you have cannot be for free right so 90% when you are giving on youtube there is some 10% for my students also which is a premium version so that's more about it so people who are more matured will understand what i'm saying right now so that's how things work and uh, 913.50 so these are the orders for the day so we sold our btst trade national alum nalco 30.95 sadly the stock went up anyways it's fine no emotion zero emotions apart from that mine tree um 903.70 is a buy price currently it is around 913.80 so close to 10 rupees movement more than 1 percentage movement of the stock so i have to withdraw the money out so i said is money also i didn't withdraw so if you don't withdraw the money any day anything goes wrong you will wipe out your so that's a mistake i do more in zeroda i don't take out the money and i do mistakes all right time is reaching 11 o'clock should i go for a limit So nine hundred and thirteen is our order. This is our order. Okay. See now, just because I put an order, someone has put an order here. See that's what I don't like in this limit order. As soon as you put an order, someone else will put an order. Market it will take off this price, this side. You see this price. So hopefully now ours should be done. Come on. Yes, that was our quantity, and our quantity has been over. So here nine hundred and thirteen. It's close to ten rupees up. Huh? i would uh, roughly say 9 rupees so uh, so 9 rupees 30 paisa or something right so anyways that's more than enough for the day i will uh, so i have to withdraw how much 26 so let's say 300 rupees will go 300 400 let's say 500 rupees will go so i have to see it is 3 lakh 25 763 so let's hold 3 lakhs round of 3 lakhs because what happens uh, when you keep 2 and 1/2 lakh in your account what happens few lots are bigger like today the lot was big like 2 lakh 44 something right uh, how much is that 2 lakh 47 so what happens if it goes little bit negative you should hold so much of margin in your account you cannot have a negative account then again penalty will come all those will come so it's better to keep more money so i maintain a 3 lakh as of now because most of the stocks i take sometimes are 2 lakh 2.2 lakh so when it is 1 lakh it is fine but when stocks are big you cannot take that stock even though you get an alert here you will not get the stock so anyways i just quit this so i have to withdraw how much uh, 25 anyways 25000 i will remove let the 700 rupees be there or let it be a brokerage or whatever so we will remove that particular amount all right uh, the market is closing the time is already 316 so if you see it came twice to 3 134.20 so hardly 50 paisa 60 paisa above our level and the stock is moving sideways today whole day so therefore what we will do we will try to hold the positions considering only 13 minutes is left So I'm not sure if it will come above our buy level 133.80. Uh, hardly 20, 30 paisa only it can move. So today there is no much blast in this uh, particular stock. It is going sideways. So what we will do? We will just hold this particular position for today also. Considering tomorrow, if there is a small spike up, we can book our profit in Manapuram Main Angel Broking. Anyways, uh, thank you so much for watching this video. Please do hit that like and subscribe. See you soon in my next video. Till then, take care. Bye bye.